G'day fish shows, Tony Bennett, Fish Camp Ski, Yarrawonga up Mole Whaler. Welcome back for another week of Mole Whaler Reports. Uh, before we get into it, once again, thanks for the positive feedback, it's great to hear. Um, especially from our interstate friends, Jamie Harris in Tasmania, um, Mark West and Murray Fisher from South Australia and even Stephen Fraser locally, so it's great to hear. Uh, keep up the good work. Um, firstly, a big apology for last week, I seem to be apologising every week. Uh, last week I gave you a weather report hot off the uh, internet. It was absolute lies. Don't trust anything I say. So this weekend I'm not going to give you anything. Last week I said it was going to be fine and no wind. It blew its ass off and rain. So sorry. Um, on the fishing, we do have a good list of uh, fish again for this week, and it is all surface, surface, surface. Uh, first of all, young Peter Guzman, young fellow was out. He'd been casting a few lures around, snagging up. The crew he was with was getting a bit shitty, so they made him put on a surface lure. Two casts in, bang, he's got a legal off the top. So not bad for a young kid around 10 years old. So well done, Peter. Next up, Darren Thielen. Uh, Darren, this fish was from a couple of weeks ago, but he's just reported in it was 97 centimetres off the top. So great effort, Darren. Well done. Naomi Hitchcock, a local young girl, 94 centimetres off the top two nights ago with the boyfriend, Joel Thomas. So a personal best. Uh, great fish, great effort. Well done, Naomi. Sneaking up the tree a bit more. Dylan Hanley, Dylan Hanley, 102 centimetre on a Kingfisher Mantis off the top. So again, beautiful fish, great effort Dylan, but certainly fish of the week. Uh, off the bank it was casting 120 centimetres to Wally Chepper. This was caught on a Jackal Pompadour. Uh, beautiful fish, great stuff Wally. But while on the Pompadours, um, has been a common theme. The hooks on them aren't designed for your Mawala fish or big fish fishing off the top. So uh, anyone that's looking at getting feed income with them, upgrade, certainly upgrade your trebles. Down below the river, uh, below the weir, in the river, uh, the fishing has been good there. Plenty of undersized stuff and there's some good reports of yellows. So anyone that's looking to fill their bag with some yellows, uh, head downstream. Finishing up just our three competitions coming up in the next few weeks. We've got the Dash for Cash, 20th and 21st of Feb. Uh, still some room there. Uh, the His and Hers Partners Classic on the 5th of March. If you're looking to get into that, give us a call. And also the Cod Nationals, 17th to the 22nd of April. But um, that's it for this week, folks. Um, all the best, happy fishing, and maybe see you at Nagambi Fishing Comp this weekend.